guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Clarabelle Nightingale here, back at it with another video. So as you can see, we are with Molly, because, um, yeah, but yeah, we're gonna start her series now, it's pretty late, and this is going up tomorrow. Also, you're probably like, why did you choose Lost River? Um, it's cause like, the ground and my scent view. My scent view is broken, so I can't see any scent spores or tracks. And the ground on Amethyst and Lost River is invisible, but with Lost River, they didn't change like some of the programming for the elk. So a lot of the elk like to still stay in a lot of the same spots. But the Lost River. You are a wild gray wolf born in Yellowstone. But now far from your family pack, looking for a place to call home. In this new valley across the range, there are strange scents, but none are human. So you decide to explore and hunt some elk. If you can survive here, you might then try and find a mate to keep you company. But you won't be able to have pups. You will soon. Oh, wow. Look at her stats. Look at those stats. Learn to hunt. Learn how to hunt the prey animals here, mostly elk, but also mule deer and moose. You'll have to become a good hunter before you can persuade another wolf to become your mate. Okay. We are here. So, here are her stats again. And here's her bio. Oh, I gotta change the fact that it's 4F. I'll change that after we get the hunting done. Which we'll see how long that takes. I'm honestly just going to do the hunting in one episode, probably. Because it won't take me that long to hunt, because we're playing on easy. Because I don't play on anything but easy, unless I have a new PC, which I don't have a new PC yet. So we're just going to do this. But yeah. <clears throat> but yeah. This is also going to be a premiere because forever, for whenever I start a new series, especially with like a new wolf or something, it'll always be a premiere. So when I restart a series, so if I start another season, it'll be a premiere. Or if I start with a new wolf, it'll be a premiere. So, yeah. But after we get the hunting done, like... We'll probably leave for Amethyst, and then I'll end the episode, but for, we'll see how long it takes for me to hunt, and then I'll determine if I'll keep recording. So, um, huh. Where are these elk? They're always up here. Here's some this way. Over here. Boom, found them. I always just listen for the calls of the bull elk, because then you'll find a regular elk herd. Grr. Gerbish. Run! Do you need me to circle you? This always takes me forever to get them to run. Because they're like the Elk and Lost River are a bit more stubborn. When you're not gonna run, I'm gonna make you- I'm gonna make ya. How to make an Elk run. 101. Bite them. There we go. And then you just see who falls behind. 
or tries to turn and fight you. So that's what we're gonna do. Can't wait to get a PC. Y'all could have this guy, I guess. Trample damage. I think we're honestly just gonna look for an oak calf if this herd has any. We didn't uh, take enough damage from that fall for me to consider hunting you. Oh dear. We're taking a bit of damage. This is so hard. I haven't had to do any hunting like this in a while, so. Oh dear, the leg spike. Which is never good when you're hunting elk. Did not get enough of a bite to determine how. Should have let go on that one. Can I see the mom at all? No. But I got the elk calf. Nice. Got him. So we're gonna eat and then we're gonna sleep so that way we can heal up. Am I gonna try and hunt from that herd again? Probably. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do that. Anyways. We're right over that hill, so. Like, why the heck not? Do you want me to bite you? Thank you. Do I see any other elk calves? I do. I always look for elk. If I can. You always gotta look for the elk calves, if you can. It's not as weak as I would like. An elk calf to be. But. Let's go. Does Molly have any patience for hunting? No. Basically me, but I don't have any patience either, so. <laughs> Got him. Only nine minutes, we're good. I am surprised that took only nine minutes. You've learned to hunt. You've learned the basics of hunting. Keep improving your skills. 
You'll need to be an ex excellent hunter to keep your pups alive in the spring. Okay. Find a mate. We're going to skip tips for this and not even going to read it because we are going to save the game here. I'm just going to name it Molly. Return to main menu. And we'll see if we can find a um, mate for her. You know, but I'm just gonna quickly modify Wolf as well. And we're gonna take out four. And continue. Amethyst Mountain. Yep. Right. Now we want Permadeath Mod for this series. And then easy. Start game. With. Um. A cougar is more than a match for a single wolf, but they try to avoid fighting. Interesting. Do, 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 do. Load game. Everything. No. Return to Amethyst Mountain. You have returned to the slopes of Amethyst Mountain where elk are plentiful and dispersal wolves roam. Looking for a mate, these are for looking for a mate. These are familiar haunts for an experienced wolf like you, but as always, danger and death are never far away. Boom, immediately full health, full sleep, full everything. Learn to hunt! And no, find a mate. There we go. Winter is coming, so it's time to start looking for a mate. Out there, you'll find dispersal wolves like yourself, who have left their family pack in search of a mate to start a new pack with. If you venture into other pack territories, you'll meet wolves who are will fiercely defend their territory, and some who might be able to you might be able to persuade to believe their pack and become your mate. So we're gonna howl. I have yet to hear her howls still, so that's her first howl. And secondary. So. We're gonna go this way. Well, took a bit of damage there, but we're gonna go in the direction of these wolves because they're closest. So. She's not as fast, but she's got stamina, so she can run for a bit of a ways before. She can no longer run, which I like about her. I also love the Amethyst music. I thought I was hearing dispersal wolves in this direction. Weird. Yeah. We're gonna howl again because... Welcome to the life of a wolf trying to find a mate. It's not probably actually like this, I mean... It takes several days for somebody to become your mate, but... This way. Sounds like they're on the move. So we better hurry. Oh dear. Hey, beloved. Um, da -da 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 -da. So, be right back. I gotta turn off my alarm. So, and we are. And we're back. If 
I will be there to spread the wolves in this direction. Me never making up my mind. So. But eh, I don't care. Precursor. 15 minutes. Oh my gosh, they're close. They are really close. You guys can't hear it, but I can hear it in my headphones. They're pretty close. But then again, wolf howls can be heard from miles and miles away. Dispersal wolves ahead. One or more dispersal wolves are just ahead. They are looking for a mate. Show your interest by play bowing, waving your tail, and other friendly actions. Yes. Yet. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no. No. Um, so I think it was either, uh, Destiny or Black Fire, her grandfather, who wound up becoming mate with a canyon wolf. So... No, no, that that would be her mom. Yep, that would be her mom, who wound up becoming mates with 25M from Canyon. So, that would be considered incest. <laughs> no, we're not doing that. Nope. Nope. That just sounds like a literal nightmare. A literal nightmare. Oh dear. Not to mention we have to find a wolf who um is probably a gray wolf. I feel like Molly would probably go for a gray wolf. Round one. I'm gonna check if she's a KK. Yeah, she's a big K, small K. I always have to remove like a double uh there's Sometimes it's a wolf quest bug. I have yet to report it, but uh, it's like where you get a double space in between words. I did not do that. Because I don't write the fact that they're uh, the offspring of anybody. I still have to add Eris to Lotus Moon Pack in their bio. Which actually we're going to do that now. So it's H A I. Air, and then E S S, Air is. I think I think that's it. Air is to pack. Air is to load some pack. Okay. We'll probably have to fix that soon, but I'll check the spelling to it. One, yeah, yes. Ooh, Hayden Dispersal Wolves. Oh, I think he has the puffy coat. It's an um, NPC coat. So four years old, two years old, and three years old. I really do like the two-year-old dispersal. Hello. Yeah. He does, he is laying down, but then again, we're not doing anything. We'll see. We'll try and start the trial with him. Yeah, we're fine. But, um, oh, one of them has, um, her grant, her great, okay. So, great, 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 great grandma's howl. Oh, yeah, she'll, oh, so he's a bit playful as well. But if we do wind up becoming, um, like, um, trial mates with them, um, but if we do, uh, wind up becoming mates with them, make sure you do leave name suggestions. Down in the comments below, you will have 
some episodes to do that. I think it's two or three courtship. Yes, you've convinced these wolves to get to know you. Nice. Um, I think we're gonna play a bit coy. We're gonna play a bit coy. Okay, let's check what he looks like. Oh my gosh, he's so pretty! I think he has one of the gorgeous gray coats. It's not a puffy coat. We'll check which one he has. This is actually going to be our thumbnail because this is so cute. There we go. I'm going to let him fully play that way. There we go. All right. Hang on. Thumbnail. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. I love his coat. I have never run into this coat yet. I think we're gonna greet him a bit. Oh, he, he's playing. So he has one of the gorgeous grays. Hang on. Um, he has third mother. I cannot tell about the one in the back. I think it looks like he has a, um, hang on. I think we're gonna like try and greet them. Yeah, he has third mother. Let's look. Yeah, he has the coxcanut, I think. Hang on, let me check under the chin. Yes, he has the coxcanut, which is an NPC coat. Um, sorry about that. I just get so caught up with the coats because there's so many that are so pretty. And that's not even the, um, I think she likes them a lot. And that's not even the NPC coats. There's oh, 60, there are 60 choosable coats and I think like 20, maybe, I think 20 NPC coats. So in total, that is, that is 80 coats. <laughs> Cause I think there's 10 different, um, there are 10 different black and gray NPC coats, I think. Yeah. So. Nobody in our, um, in the history of our packs has gone with a Hayden yet, I don't think. So, we're good. Which means any boys that we will have will be over 50. Because I go based off of whatever kind of mate, like if we get a boy or a girl mate, then I will go based off of their number for the boys. Why? I have no idea. But I do love this co coat. I think it's the mouse coat. I'll check later and I'll tell you. Yeah, we can play. Courtship. Progress. You've made an impression on this wolf. Now hunt and socialize together for several days so you can learn about each other's personality and abilities. You'll gradually increase affinity. The blue meter on left edge on the left edge of the wolf badge. When it's full, you can decide about becoming mates. Do you agree? Yes. I do like him. So Let's give him a little tail wag. Actually, wait, no, this is... Hang on, I want him to go back to rolling. Roll, can you roll, please? Hang on, I want you to roll. I want him to roll so that way I can like Wag my tail at him and get that as a thumbnail pick. He has not seemed interested in doing that. I don't think. But actually, let's just end this off. 
uh, with a cute little chin rest. That is cursed, so we're not going to do that. Anyways, if you like this video, then you might like others. Make sure you give this video a pause up and subscribe. Also, make sure you hit that bell notification so that way you don't miss any single time I upload. Make sure you leave a comment down below, especially on name suggestions. Tell me what you think of this wolf. I'll see you in the next one, and bye, guys!